Hi there everybody, this is Russian man who brings value through my own experiences and today I'm gonna watch a Bill Burr comedy to learn English because I'm Igor, I'm George from Russia and I want to be an American and how to move to America without English, I don't know, need to improve it daily. Let's do this and also you can click a like button and subscribe to this channel, it will be really nice because I always do content about my English journey and about my experiences around it. Let's do this together. Let's dive. Bill Burr. By the way, I will not understand maybe some phrases, maybe will, uh, because my English is good, but it's, it's not good enough uh, to understand full cultural experience. Okay, let's join it. If uh, you are so like a healthy body, then you can uh, leave in the comment section below what uh, does it mean, what some phrases mean to in your language, okay? Let's let's watch it. Been in a uh, bad mood all day, man. All day. Got in a fight with this girl the other day. You ever meet somebody like within like the first couple of minutes of them meeting you, they feel like they can like sum you up? Just like, you know what your problem is? You know, you just have like the urge just to take their head and just mush it into whatever they're eating, you know? You ever have crazy thoughts like that? Can you relate on any level? You never have like urges? You ever drive down the street and see like 30 people up on the sidewalk and you just think, <laughs> right? Is it like a GTA game? Like, uh, let's kill them? 30 people on the sidewalk, uh, like uh, on, on a car or what? You don't do it, you just think it. That's what separates the psychos from the functioning psychos. <laughs> yeah, psychos, they just do it. All right, that's a good idea. <laughs> they get the wipers going, they make a day out of it, right? But a rational person, you, you like think it through. You start going, you man, if I just leave my hand right here, nobody knows who I am. I move it two degrees over here. I'm on the cover of Newsweek. I'm instantly famous. Right here, no one instantly knows me. Famous. Like, hey, Bill, you want to go to the cookout? Maybe you can bring that potato salad you brought last year. It was such a big hit. One of the most horrific scenes we've seen in years. Bodies just strewn about. You know, Amy... Guys, by the way, sorry. I, I stopped it uh, because sometimes... I understand his real speech, but I don't understand his impressions. I speak not so loud because uh, it is uh, morning right now and I don't want to wake up my grandma. And uh, uh, I don't understand this kind of speech when he speaks these different uh, voices. And it is kind of hard to me. Accent kind of non-understandable. I don't know why. How to improve it? Maybe need to listen more of it. Let's go. He's gonna be there. She's still asking for you. You should ask her out. No indication he even tried to stop. <laughs> Seriously, you're getting older. Put your hands on the dashboard. Put them on the dashboard. Oh, I know what is dashboard. Dashboard, it is a specific, uh, like, when speed occurs, when things um, from a car we can find, like, uh, like uh, number of your uh, fool. Yes? <laughs> It is dashboard. No, I have that stuff all the time. I do. I do. My girl took me to a street fair recently, right? By the way, uh, one moment. He speaks like all the time. I have that s stuff all the time. I do. He used this kind of uh, sentences because it is not first video of Bill Burr that I w I'm watching. And uh, he use uh, this kind of phrases. I have this stuff all the time. I do like a sentence formula in the in the last last words of a sentence. I do like a, I I do like a, I have I have a like a psycho dog at my home. I do like or maybe I smashed someone on muffin. I do like. Uh, I did. It is kind of interesting phrase. Uh, I didn't uh, thought about. I didn't think about it before. I do. My girl took me to a street fair recently, right? You guys have street fairs out here? Street fair? Is it uh, like uh, from Peter Pan? You know, they close off the block. There's like shawarma. There's like stuff made out of shawarma. buttons, right? People with no teeth are making keychains, right? 
It's a typical girlfriend idea. It sucks, and it's gonna take all Saturday, right? <laughs> She's all excited. She's like swinging my arm. Oh my God, this is gonna be great. I'm like praying for lightning. <laughs> Maybe some like scaffolding to fall down on me, you know? No, we show up, right? The first thing she sees is this big table and nothing but homemade jewelry, right? Homemade jewelry. It's got twigs, macaroni in it. It's just, it's a table of crap. It's crap. The whole thing is crap. But she loves it. She's like, oh my God, look at these earrings. Do you like these? Do you think these are nice? I just want to be like, no. They were nice. They'd, they'd be in a store, all right? There'd be a roof. Some sort of structure would be built around this. This is... There'd be a roof. Some sort of structure would be built around this. It is kind of funny. Like a description of house. It's crap. This is just a table of crap. The guy's even wearing shoes. That's a good indication that this is crap. But I don't want to ruin a day, so I'm like, yeah, go ahead, check it out. I'm gonna go get some air. Even though we're outside, I think there's more air to be had, right? <laughs> so I walk like three, four tables away, and I come up to this lady. She got this big table of nothing but muffins. Muffins, right? It's like 80. I heard it a bit about muffins, but about jewelry, I didn't hear. Ah, uh, fairs! I understand what is it. Fairs, it is not like a fairy tales or maybe some of the magical creatures. Fairs, it is specific place, like uh, in a medieval. Medieval, yes? When uh, it is like uh, some of the bots, some of the burglars, some of uh, hobbits, maybe, and uh, around we can find many of how to say it, this uh, new moon, new moon fairs from World Warcraft game, you know it, it is uh, like when you can, f it is like a market store, but uh, opened, open air market store. Five degrees out, she's selling muffins and she's got this big stupid, eh, look at the muffins I made, look on her face. And the second I saw that, that part of my brain was just like, dude, what would happen if you just walked up and just said, hey, lady, uh, these your muffins? Oh, yeah? And I just started going, blam, 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 blam. Like, how many of these muffins could I mush before anybody did anything? What does it mean, mush? Mush it is kind of smash or what? Mush. Interesting word. I didn't know it. I mean, realistically, I think I could have got the whole table. Because even if you saw me doing that, it would take at least five to six seconds to process. Like, did they say he could do that? Is, is it like a game? Do you eat the muffin off your fist? That just seems like a waste of pastry. Fist. You know? Waste of no pastry. Waste of past pastry. Need to... Pastry. What is it? Pastry meaning. The, a duff of flour, fat and water used to a base and covering in baked dishes such as pies. Oh, pastry, dough of floor, an item of food consisting of sweetie pastry with a cream jam or fruit filling. Okay, in the Russian language, what is it? Ah, okay, I understand, it's like a bakery. Bakery in another way of speaking. Security at a street fair, there's no bouncer staying there, he's mushing the muffins. Привет! Доброе утро! My no grandma woke up. At a street fair. There's no bouncer staying there. He's mushing the muffins. Okay, I'm on it. Sir, we're gonna have to ask you to leave. And they just choked me out. So I just started thinking of the horrified look on this lady's face as I started slamming these muffins. And out of nowhere, I just started laughing like a maniac. Maniac. Ah! I'm like slumped over this fried dough cart. I'm dying. <laughs> My girl looks at me. She's like, what the hell are you laughing at? And like an idiot, I actually tried to explain <laughs> this screwed up thought to her. I swear to God, I'm just sitting there like, I was just thinking, what if I started punching the muffins? You know what I mean? I just started punching them. <laughs> She's just looking at me like, why do I go out with you? I, I like Bill Burr for this psycho things because I... I have these psycho things inside of me sometimes, and not really sometimes, I do. I have them really frequently, I do. <laughs> Dude, but I swear to God, if I never broke eye contact the second I started hitting those muffins, 
That lady, she wouldn't even been able to call for help. I would have been in her head. She'd be like, did I go to high school with this guy? Why would you do that? Muffins are a happy food. I, I don't understand this. No, I gotta learn to, uh, I gotta learn to let stuff go. I do, I got issues. I do. My neighbor got her, uh, got her dog fixed. Got this dog neutered, brand new dog, puppy. Puppy. Got the thing neutered, and I'm like, what the hell, what the hell did you do that for? She's like, what is, well, you know, What is neuter? Got the thing neutered, and I'm like, Got the thing neuter, 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 meaning, okay. Neuter, sorry for this, because I want to improve English. And uh, neutering from the Latin neuter is the removal of an animal's reproductive organ. Ah, I understand, okay. What the hell, what the hell did you do that for? She's like, well, you know, if I didn't do that, he was going to hook up with another dog. Then they're going to make more dogs. And what are we going to do with all these dogs? It's like, why don't you just let them go? They're animals. They'll be fine. I think that's what every city needs. Just a nice pack of wild dogs just running down the street. It help with the obesity problem. Just chase people in the cars after they do some big meat. Obesity. Obesity is like uh, when people uh, got uh, get when people get uh, bigger. Okay, again. It help with the obesity problem. Just chase Funny. people in the cars after they do some big meal, you know? Big meal. Just a nice pack of Rottweiler just running down the street. <laughs> just riding down the street. Listen, I'm out of time. You guys were awesome. Thank you so much. He, yeah, thank you so much, Bill Burr. I understood this uh, jokes uh, not fully. I didn't understand about fair enough about jewelry house. I didn't understand. Okay, what have I learned from this video? It is like a summary. First story w was about uh, about psycho things. Uh, what separates psycho bit, uh, and uh, functional psycho? We have type of psycho that thinks inside of uh, your head like uh, you think how to kill someone but it's kind of joking you only imagine it you only imagine like what will be if i will drive on my car and uh, i will hit this 30 people on on the sidewalk like imagining but you will not do because you are not functional psycho and uh, it uh, it is what separates us from them and uh, next story was about jewelry, I didn't understand it. About muffins, I understood. It is about uh, when he punched it and he tried to explain to his, his girlfriend and uh, she didn't understand, like she was looking, what, what are you talking about? Like, uh, I, I don't imagine, I don't imagine people who don't think this way like of psycho. I'm kind of psycho inside of me too. Sometimes I have thoughts about like, a, what will be if Matilda will be raped, like or something like this. It is no, it's uh, funny. It is uh, not like, it is example. Sorry, if I said something wrong, rape is is bad word. It is uh, bad things. It is kind of funny, uh, funny joke only about like, <laughs> I imagine Matilda. It is kind of. Uh, crossover of Matilda and uh, Fifty Shades of Grey and um, also <laughs> guys uh, about muffins I understood and one more story it is about uh, dog but uh, about uh, neuter neuter of dogs and I I understood it uh, like it is not like about psycho thing it is not like a previous story it is about uh, that her neighbor girl girl neighbor wanted to do a neutering to her her dog and uh, she she wanted to do this and uh, bill started to think hmm why do you want to make him without uh, his balls and penis and uh, it is kind of uh, he was upset about it and uh, kind of uh, like why why like uh, it is emotion of uh, wondering wondering would you be uh, nurturing him he can solve problem of uh, abasing of people because uh, dogs will chase people and uh, they will make them work harder it will be like a workout routine yes and uh, we have uh, dogs all, all 
all over the place. We have uh, dogs everywhere. And uh, why don't you let him stay with his balls? Okay. And uh, it is interesting. Interesting stand up. And I understood it. Uh, so part I, I understood it partly. I was reading a bit of. Uh, Subtitles, but it was subtitles not prepared fully. It is auto-generated subtitles, and I understood this stand up on eighty-five percent of uh, comprehension of English listening. I want to say that my English skills are improved. If I will compare it with uh, previous time, I can understand English movies with without subtitles because we have pictures but stand up it's kind of harder because we can we only imagine it and we only can look at gestures not like uh, on actions yes stand up it is kind of hard to understand thing and if i will understand it then everything will be good because it is not like a uh, english news english news it is kind of easy because uh, it is kind of uh, rp english uh, like a right pronunciation and uh, here is uh, kind of not ri right and uh, here we have impressions too and uh, if i can be able to understand it then i am a god of english <laughs> yes and thank you so much for watching you are a cool guy or girl please always improve yourself daily find something to yourself if you want to improve english or maybe improve even Russian or something like this, uh, you can do this by learning. See you next time. It was Igor.